Alright, start new season. So we have no offers there yet. I just wanted to see what it would say if I tried selecting it, but it's giving me this whole thing. Reach level 3 in auto splints, okay, and level 6 and level 9. Alright, so we know how to get to that now. So, next up guys, do you want to do endurance, open wheel, tuner, or street? Cast your votes now. Call this toll free number, no. <laughs> Cast your votes, cast your votes. That was, that was a really long set of races there, holy crap. So far I've been dividing them into like uh, a touring car has its own video and endurance race has its own video and stuff like that on YouTube when I upload it afterwards, but that was like an hour and a half almost right there for just touring, that's, that's stupid. Traffic, make up your mind. So I've got traffic voting for street twice, as well as tuner. <laughs> uh, Whisker kid, open wheel, street. That, that means, or so traffic. I'm gonna count your two streets as one. <laughs> so that that leaves two streets, a tuner, and an open wheel. Does anyone want to oppose this street thing? Because that's what it sounds like. What's going on now? Will I be playing Armored Warfare? Um, time to Google it. Yeah, ammo. Oops, can't type. Uh, I'll have to look at the actual Armored Warfare trailer. It looks like it's could be neat, but I haven't heard of it. I'll leave that tab open in Chrome. <laughs> well, it's like World of Tanks but with newer tanks. That that could be Street seems to be the one that's voted on the most. Um, so we're going here. Six events, one cup, two offers. Um, Monster Energy Racing are still looking to you to bring them results, despite a tough ride last season. Check out the offer and see if it suits you. Finish sixth or above in the championship, finish fourth or, fourth or above in the team championship. Um, fifth or above, sixth or above. 84 and 65, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, that's 4,900 total, or, wow, that's not 49. That's 14. Okay, I missed the, the, the number. <laughs> 14,900 or. Oh, math. Uh, 16. 46. Yeah, monster is better. <laughs> God, math. Beta's coming out quick, okay? Hmm. I see the big sign up for beta button. I'll have to uh, check that out. We want to put ourselves ahead right from the first race. If you want to make a mark, then finish ahead of this guy. Alrighty, practice. Do we want to practice? No. Practice does give us more practice <laughs> and points potentially too, I think. Uh, we're just going to go to the race though, even though I probably should practice. 
looking over at my game caster, I've dropped 25 frames this whole stream in the last 75 minutes. Hmm. That's like almost a second of video lost within 75 minutes. This track looks familiar. This track looks familiar from the old ones. Oh, this car is much more responsive. Oh, we're driving on cobblestone. If I had a controller right now with the vibrate, uh, the force feedback thing. Oh man, I was expecting a left turn. Then my controller would probably be shaking something bad this whole time. All right. My car seems a little deformed after that impact. It's just not quite right anymore. Hey, stop it. <laughs> what did you do, Drepik? How did you get yourself to be modded now? Did you have to refresh the page or something stupid like that? That's probably all it was. You guys are talking about a sword before the sword actually. What? I know you guys are talking about the sword beside Drapik's name. <laughs> Drapik didn't do anything. <laughs> Twitch is just a little bit delayed. Which is having difficulties. It must be scared of Amazon. Steering is damaged. Get back here. No. I need to stop drifting around corners. It cuts down my speed. The paint job on my bumper. Somebody did not know how to draw a straight line. I crossed it. They're like, yeah, this is this is straight enough. All right, now my engine's damaged. Ford seems to be damaged easier than the other cars I drove and tuner. Oh man, those guys had a bit of a tangle too. I don't need another racer to tangle if I just smash them up into walls of my own. So wide, cut it sharp, and most of my windows are gone too. That's fine. That that removes some weight that we didn't need. I wonder how that works aerodynamically for vehicles if it has no windows. So the vehicles are designed to be aerodynamic with the with everything intact, including the windows. Uh, so I wonder if you remove the windows, does it mess that whole? perfect aerodynamic thing up or does it make it more aerodynamic because suddenly the the air can flow through the car as well although through the car wouldn't be a smooth surface like the roof I think it would probably be more aerodynamic with all the windows than without all the windows the hmm. this race. I did? why am I in fourth? Why am I bouncing off the walls? If I'm so good, supposedly. And yeah, my you're right, my, uh, Trooper. My teammates absolutely suck. Uh, they're not even as good as the other players. It seems like if you're playing at a certain difficulty level, then the teammates are uh, just as are. You know, all the other players, the AI players, they're skilled at a certain level. And it seems like your teammate is skilled down a level. Like it's intentionally there to. Uh, you a disadvantage. You'd think he'd do just as well as the other racers, so you know, sometimes he'd come first, sometimes he'd come last, but I don't know. I 
slowed down too much for that corner. Didn't trust my car, which is probably a good thing, but... I wonder how much money Codemasters had to spend on on this game to get all the licenses to show like the Ford logo and all the other car brands and stuff like that. And if you were Ford, you'd be dumb, especially if you were a smaller car company, you'd be dumb not to allow a game uh, usage rights on your logo, even if it was for free. So, I mean, it's, it's so much more... Um, don't pass me. Don't pass me. It's just so much more advertising. I know in games too, car dealers often really, really don't like their cars being shown all beat up. So we'll have that at level 3 by the end of this session. San Francisco short circuit. The long circuit looks nice. I wonder if it's similar to the one... There, there was a track in the first grid. I remember playing the demo on the PS3 when I first got the PS3. And that's the demo that got me into the game. That's the reason I went and bought the game on eBay after because I couldn't find it in stores. Uh, that was in 2008 that the first game was released. And I bought it in like 2010 or 11 or something like that. Um, but I, I wonder if that track's in here. In the demo, you were driving a Ford Mustang on. Uh, it was probably San Francisco. So, you know, the roads were hilly enough that you could jump off the end of them and get some air. Wow. You're kidding me. That was just dumb. My car just sat there spinning its tires, too. Oh my god. You're kidding me. Go, car. Go. So many balloons. This is the track. I don't know if it's the right variation, but this is the track that was in that demo. Mm, I don't recognize this part. No, this is definitely a different variation of the track. Must have been the full long circuit, because this was near the end. Yeah. Man, I'm in last. I'm doing horrible. Alright, time to concentrate. And then crash into a wall. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm falling behind. This car has no power. Oh my god, I took that corner all wrong. Start wide and cut it tight so we can keep some speed. Keep as close to the walls as possible. track was so much more fun with the tuner class. And it was actually the full track, not a little tiny thing like this. Okay, we're not last. That's an accomplishment. But we're spinning out and crashing into stuff now. Not two of five, tenth place. Race half done. We've gained very few positions. God, that corner, why is that so slippery? This car sucks. I hate this car. <laughs> I 
has no power on his front wheel drive, which is annoying. I think. For my driving style, at least. I like the rear wheel drive vehicles better. And spinning out in this corner again. Such a horrible car. There's 8th place. Oh, and he's pushed us into a wall. You're not getting back ahead of me. My steering's damaged now. Crashing into that wall. Wall. More walls. Ah. Last lap, let's push through now. Whoa. Where'd you guys come from? Oh, I took a screenshot. And I should've I should use that opportunity to get a roundup. Let's try that again. Oh man, what kind of what? Uh, I'm using all my replay, all my rewinds on this little corner. Out of my way. Turn sharper. I need to like adjust this vehicle's downforce or something because it's. Front wheels don't grip at all. Even when I hit the brakes and turn into the corner, it that should make the t front tires dig in, but they just don't. Ah. <laughs> just trying to get around him in the last second, try to spin him out too. Oh my God, that was rough. That was horrible. horrible. Finish higher than ninth and finish ahead of your teammate. And well that's obviously gonna happen. <laughs> Even if we get second to last, he's gonna be the one to last. Set the fastest lap in a race event. I did that. Apparently. Oh I did that in the first one. Continue on. Event three of six. That's a lot of events. That's twelve races. We're currently fourth in the team standings. That's put us in a really strong position. Try to beat Nathan McCain to really create a gap. All right, we're in the we're in the minis at least this time. Let's do a practice, at least a couple practice laps, because that last one was just so horrible. I, I, oh, we're in this car. Your voice changed. I thought we were in minis or something this time. This track looks familiar from the first race in the second grid. Wall. Alright, trying to remember as much of the track as I can. And what driving lines are coming up and stuff.
break for that corner. Preferably a little bit more so I don't slide around it so I can actually drive controlled around it. Alright, we'll do one more practice lap and then that'll be it. That's not how you take that corner. Alright, uh, let's turn the paddock. Is that what I want? I think that's what I want. Let's go ahead and uh, break bias differential gear ratios, ride height, uh, suspension. Oh, I can't uh, just downforce. Low. Lowering the suspension would help downforce, would it not? This is why I don't mess with these things. I want to make the thing grip the road a little more, specifically the front end. Suspension, I could change that. Uh, soft suspension would help. Grip, but... Uh, wouldn't necessarily help control. Let's. Oh man, this, I don't even a half. I was hoping there would be like a halfway between, but wow. It's 150 or nothing. Well, let's let's see what that does. I guess. We'll see, we'll see what happens. I could wait for you guys' advice to come in, but which will be in like five seconds. <laughs> North corners equals better race, for sure. We'll see how this feels in the on the track. Like a demo derby through the first corner. Oh my god. Using them to corner so much for figuring out exactly the best race lines and stuff like that. Or trying to. Oh man. So I'm just pushing everybody around and they're all pushing me around and using them as my corner assist dents. That might be a little bit better. It's hard to tell, though. <laughs> Maybe I should have lowered it. Or uh, softened the suspension even more. Yep, should have softened it more. Oh, steering damaged. Hopefully it pulls left, because there's so many left turns. Oh, I thought that was going to be a sharper corner. That's why I started going wide. Fifth place so far. If we can gain a couple more, I'll be happy. Third lap now. Pick up the pace. Need that podium position. Sorry, not really, but sorry. I'm sorry I hit you rather than flying around you. The sparks coming down from the subway lines. Above ground, above ground subway. 
That seems dangerous. Need to get that fixed. Seeing the city reminds me of uh, whenever I go to the, the city. Where I live, it's a city, but it's more spread out than anything. Uh, so when you actually go to a city like Toronto, where I went to the Ripley, uh, Ripley's Aquarium of Canada a few days ago, Set the fastest lap this race. which those pictures are on my website if you guys haven't seen those yet. Just uh, going over to spacegk.com, oh, damaged my engine, and go over to the gallery page, and there's a little tiny link, because I haven't finished that page yet, to the, the page with all the pictures and stuff on it. But going to the city, one of the things I like to see is just all the different designs of buildings. It's just neat to see if, which I won't, but if I ever happen to take part in designing a, a huge skyscraper like that, like I said, well, I won't, but it would, I would try to design something unique, something that maybe people are going to drive by and be like, huh, that's neat. Second place? Oh, when do we get into second place? I wasn't paying attention at all. Let's go for first while we're here. I mean, I'll take second, but... If I can have first, then sure, why not? Is there not for Twitch? Yes, there is. You're in second. Close in on first. I know there's one on Android. Pretty sure there's one on iOS. Remember, iPhone 6 coming supposedly this year. Two of them. 4.7 and the 5.5 inch screen ones, which I imagine they'll release the bigger one at a later date, because more people are going to want the bigger one, probably. So they'll force people to buy the smaller one, and then people, some people will want to replace this, the 4.7 inch screen with the 5.5 inch screen later on, and a new iPad next year. Again, rumors, but it sure seems like it. So if you're an Apple person, and you're thinking about upgrading, wait a few more months. If I could have any gold tank in World of Tanks, what would that be? Um... That's a really good question. I have the T-34 because I owned that before it became a premium tank. Not a huge fan of it. It has its days where it's good, but uh, a lot of the times I'm not a huge fan of it. Type 59, after playing the T-54, it doesn't seem that great, but the Type 59 is pretty good. Um, I haven't played the IS-6 or any of the other premium heavies. Um, let's see that. I have the SU-100Y, which is a tier 6 tank destroyer. That thing's pretty fun. But it's a glass cannon. It's got a big gun, but pretty much no armor. So, uh, you've got to like that kind of tank to like that. It's one of my favorite, though. And the, the E-25, which is like the complete opposite. It's just a little tiny stealthy thing. It's pretty much you get detected in that thing, and you're about to get hurt bad. Um, so you need to fire from, from cover and know how to camel works to make full use of the E25. Did I say E75? I meant E25. Um, it's possibly my favorite right now, the E25. The little tier 7 tank destroyer. Is your graphics holding up for the Google modular phone. That thing is pretty neat. Just swap out your processor whenever you want and swap out your RAM and memory and all kinds of different things. If you haven't seen that, then maybe Drepic can post a link to that in the chat. Real quick. So now you posted one in in the Skype Keeping group a while ago. We want to place ahead of them. And I enjoyed looking at that. Is this a different car now? What was a different car? You're in position 12. Oh, the Panzer 2J and the BTSV. Ooh. I want a, pan, uh, a Panzer 2J. Those things, that's so overpowered. 
and the worst part is you're going to run into so many players that just don't know how to kill a, a basic tank because they haven't ha played that many battles. Holy crap, this car is fast. Wow, how many hoods just flew off there? That car's on its side. <laughs> uh, but a lot of players don't even know how to hurt a regular tank the best way, let alone hurt one of those things at that tier. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a tier 2, I believe, right? And it's got as much armor as the KV-2. It's like a tier 6 heavy. Or it's KV-1. Uh, anyway, it's got a, a crazy amount of armor for its tier. Its gun is enough. Oh man, that hurt really bad. Suspension am suspension um I was gonna say ammo, suspension engine steering. Don't hit the wall. Oh that damaged my steering again. Engine shiny. The BTSV. Wow, I slowed down way too much. Uh, I don't know, it doesn't seem as, as good to me, but... But yeah, if anyone has a Panzer II J that they want to get off their hands, uh, hi! <laughs> but no, I looked into getting one of those, you gotta like buy the World of Tanks box set and it's, it'll cost you like 200 bucks to actually buy one because they're, they're rare and they're... they're they're well sought after. Um, and to be honest, they're probably going to rebalance stuff at the lower tier soon. Wargaming has said that they're going to do that soon. Rebalance the lower tiers more. Um, so I, I suspect a, a nerf coming to a few vehicles. And a buff to others, hopefully. Push me into the wall. That was close, but oh, jeez! That cost me a lot of time. I should probably rewind that. But knowing my luck, I'll mess it up like four more times now. All right. Oh, I'm still in the middle of that spin out when I resumed. I like this car so much better than the Ford before. What is this car anyway? Why am I slowing down again? I've been playing with the uh, FE215B183 a little more after its big nerf. It's, it's still got it. I think hash rounds are still the rounds to use if you can afford them. Um, they don't do max damage as much as they did before because... Um, because they had less penetration now, obviously, but but when they do penetrate, uh, the penetration value it, it's like a, a true or false kind of thing. It penet either penetrates the armor or it doesn't. Uh, if it does, then it doesn't matter how much penetration it does after it has penetrated because it does the same amount of damage. I noticed Quickie Baby when he was talking about his 9.2 and it's one of his 9.2 review videos. He was saying that the uh, the 215B183 is probably going to do less damage, less splash damage now because it because it has less penetration. Mm, no, it's not. Maybe if it's hitting spaced armor. No, actually, no. It wouldn't. No, it would make a difference because hash rounds explode after they go through one layer of spaced armor, regardless. Um, so. Hesh rounds, the amount of penetration it has. If it doesn't penetrate, it won't affect the amount of damage it does. Uh, if that, hopefully that makes sense. That seemed like a lot of gibberish in that sentence. Uh, I've never played the KV series of tanks, so I'll have to try that soon. I guess going to be talking about World of Tanks again. <laughs> Every game I play, I'm talking about World of Tanks.
But uh, yeah, that that 183, one shotting tier 10 mediums. <laughs> oh, that's so fun. No ammo rack or anything required. Don't mind my phone vibrating. Game Breaker TV, welcome to Twitch, and I'm the Paladin King, <laughs> welcome, and the same to Trooper. I didn't know you weren't uh, already following me, but welcome. We're currently first in the team standings. That's put us in a really strong position. Try to beat Nathan McCain to really create a gap. Welcome to Dubai and the next event to the Street Circuit League. It's certainly a race that... Alrighty, hopefully I'm not back in that stupid fort again. You're in position 12, and your teammate is fifth on the grid. Alright, I'm not. Cool. You've got to place ahead of Nathan McCain. You can take them. Let's see how this goes. Seems like a very fast track. Oh, and there's a corner coming up. If you go really fast, then whoops! What the heck? I was like stuck on his door or something. That's weird. Let's try this corner again. No one will probably mess up this time around, but I'm gonna take it a little bit wider just to be sure. Yep. No one <laughs> crashed that time around, of course. Oh man, traction loss. Corner. Seventh place. All right, so we're up pretty much half the field after one lap. Let's see if we can do that again this time around, though, because it's been a lap. They're going to be more spaced out, so we'll be doing good to get up to third, I think. That transition under the different surface is crazy. Alright, there's fourth place. I like this car. It handles much nicer. You've set the fastest lap this race. I should be drafting these guys. Stick it behind them. Be the most aerodynamic I can. And get beside him for the turn. Looks like they're working on a construction project as we race. Don't stand up, stare into the welder's light. Ooh. All right, kind of messed that up. That messed up that overtake, and it looks like it might even cost me position there, but we'll regain it. There's second place back. Whoops. Steering is now damaged. Let's see if we can get into first within the next lap or so. Two laps left. Only problem with first is then suddenly you don't have a car in front of you to compare your your braking times and stuff like that with. It's easier to make a mistake. Same place I hit it before. I think so. 
Oops. More scuffs. Oh well. We'll get the first place prize money to fix it all up. Last lap. Hold the lead, aka don't mess up more than four times. <laughs> That's all the rewinds you've got. One thing that's nice about the street races like this, uh, you don't get hit for cutting corners so much because you can't cut a corner in most cases because there's just solid barriers in your way. Another thing I could do with the website, have you guys vote on stuff. Like, uh, have you vote on which tank I'm going to do a video on next and stuff like that. It'll give you the choices as which replays I have and... Yeah. Possibilities are pretty much endless. Alright, what's been going on in the chat for that last race? I was trying to win that one instead. Uh, Trooper. Trooper's apparently got a new account that he's following me with. It's an old one before, I guess, uh, I suppose. Graphics going crazy as... Or... Oh, no, no, it's not graphic going crazy this time. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, my favorite food. You guys, and these questions. I like the questions, but oh my god. Whiskers kid, you you you, you followed me on Twitch a second time. <laughs> yes, that sent me an email too. <laughs> uh, my favorite food. I'm not sure what my favorite food is, but uh, some of my favorites would be stuff like, I mean, who doesn't like tacos and who doesn't like pizza? Um, I really did like hamburgers, but now I work at Wendy's, <laughs> so I've had way too many of those. But it's nothing like a home barbecued um, hamburger. Uh, I like I like my meaty stuff, the meaty foods. Sushi. Ugh. <laughs> uh, I lose my appetite if I look at a fish swimming in our fish tank while I'm eating. I couldn't ever eat sushi. After this uh, street race series is done, then I have to go. There's a few more races here, though. Are you getting fat? <laughs> uh, I've gained a few pounds from the Wendy's, but uh, am I getting fat? Not really. Car speedy. Oh, that hurts. I feel like all the car components in this game have hit points. So if I crash into someone, it takes away 100 hit points, and if I get to 150 hit points, then my steering becomes damaged if it's taken a previous hit or something like that. Um, it, it seems like if I make a big impact like that, the first the first little crash like that doesn't damage anything, but then after that, little taps the wrong way will damage stuff. 
it's not just a certain size impact will knock out a component of your car. Wow, whoa, whoa. Recover. Oh, we can't recover. <laughs> I thought we were going to do a, a whole 360 there. I went into that way too fast. Let's do it again. Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's go back a little bit farther this time. Wow, that wasn't even cool, man. Alright, don't go beside him. He's going to swing back over. We'll tap him a little bit. That was fun, but <laughs> not very effective for racing. Woo! I'm flying into that corner and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm in 12th place. Dang it! It's like, oh yeah, I've got to build a turn. <laughs> There's a bit of a bend here in the road. And suddenly the slight bend turns into an impossible thing. There's my teammate. He was actually doing better than me for once. Not for long, though, if I have anything to say about it. Here we go again, fast to this corner. We kept it together that time. That's good. It's a fun corner. <laughs> Damage my steering, that's alright. It's pulling to the right this time. Oh, we're turning left. Oh. Oh, wall. Corner. Get back on the gas and go. gas to that corner. This could be difficult with damage steering. Woo! <laughs> the steering pulling me kind of tricked me there. I kind of overcorrected left a little bit when it pulled me right. So I just scraped along the wall. Engine damaged. a little bit of a difference. Fourth place, if I can maintain this, I'll be happy. It's not perfect, but I'll, I'll take it. That's gonna hurt. My car is suddenly skinnier. Alright, turn. Sharp right. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back here, guys. Get back here. Don't all pass me, jeez. Uh, they got past me right, uh, right before the last corner. longer am I going to be live streaming? Uh, after I'm done the street races here, I'm going to finish 
up for the day. Um, that's probably like another 20 minutes or something, maybe. This is event five of six that we just did there. Um, so two more races, I believe. All right, that wasn't that great, but whatever. Uh, would I like to one day have enough subscribers where I can make YouTube my full-time job? That would be neat, yes. Uh, however, I think that the way YouTube's going, um, content creators are getting less and less money from the ads uh, right on the channels, so it's becoming more and more difficult to do that. So will it ever happen? Probably not. Um, besides, I'd like to have a real career, too. But, you know, if it gets to the point where I can work part-time instead of full-time and do the YouTube thing part-time as well, that would be more content for you guys, too, and I partially work for myself, and that'd be neat, too. Oh, I'm back in the Ford, aren't I? Race one of one. All right, so this might be the last race, possibly. In this car. Oh wait, this is the same car as last time. Never mind, it's not the Ford. The paint job threw me off, which for a reason surprised me. So I like this car. This is a fun car. So this might be the last race, guys. So if you have any more questions or anything else you want to talk about before I head out, then wow, stop pushing me. Then let me know now. I'd like to do another live stream later this week, but I'm probably going to have to make the choice of live stream, oh man, or her videos for the next week. So, uh, probably won't happen. The live stream probably won't happen. I was going to originally do some video recording today instead and live stream later this week, but. I decided that I wasn't in a recording mood, so. Live streams are just a little bit easier. Oh man, I'm doing horrible. I may like this car, but I think these tracks aren't really for me. Still 12th place, come on. Let me in guys, I want to be part of your gang. I want to hang with the cool kids. Oh man, that's not how you hang with the cool kids. Oh, wall. I think this race is a scrub. No way. And I'm getting podium. So, new goal. Don't get last. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh. Uh, speed of impact 158 kilometers per hour. Force of impact almost 60 G's. Total damage, 83% damage to my car. Well, let's flash back. I messed that corner up, something bad. Let's not do it again. Yeah. Okay, better. It's a wall there, though. I do look at chat. I look at chat, guys. Don't worry. I see people asking. I try to watch it while I'm actually playing the game, but it's hard to. 
I, I definitely check it between races to try to catch up with everything I missed. I am horrible at this track. Really, really horrible. I must have missed a question or something. Is that why you're asking? I'll check again in a second. Don't worry. This Alright, I'm trying to take these corners too fast. I'm pretty sure is my problem. Pretty sure that was faster than how I've been taking them, but I think it's too late now. I realize my problems too soon. My effort is too little, too late, or too uh, some words, words. Oh my god, I'm gonna get last. Somebody get a flat tire or something, please. Somebody's engine blow. Somebody's car randomly explode. Wow. Woo, woo. All right, not last. Not last. Ah, get back here. I want to be one of the cool kids. Man, this is a horrible race to wrap things up on. But we're doing it anyway. Wow, how am I suddenly in 7th slash 8th? 8th. Guess I'm doing something right suddenly, or else they just felt bad for me and I'll slow down. Like, meh. We're not getting podium anyway, let's just let them have it. Seventh place. <laughs> I thought for sure I was gonna get last there for a while. So that's a little bit of a come, of a come, come, yeah, come down, come back. You did enough to hit your team target. All right, let's check up on the uh, the chat here. I see you guys asking to play me to play BMG Drive. I'm not gonna be doing that today though. Um, maybe next time. How come I don't be upload BMNG Drive anymore? Well, there's actually one coming out soon. Ish. Um, let's see. There will be one. In, on the third. Today's the, yeah, today's the first, so it'll be out on the third. Uh, so you'll get to see that then. Those of you all waiting for a Bmanju Drive video. Yeah, this is the last race for me, I think. I assume this is the last race in this series. So let's, um, for this event, see the season is what it's called. Yeah, this is event 6 of 6 it looks like. So let's see what we got. Uh, beat both team kicker drivers in a race event and finish higher than ninth in a race event. All right. End of season seven. Great season. Your team will be happy. You did everything they asked, and that's a clear message to the other teams that you mean business. That was horrible. How did you do everything they asked? Alright, let's... Our awards. Alrighty. Um, so... So, for Street, which is the last one, the yellow one there, uh, it is level 3 now. I need to get the Endurance, the Open Wheel, and the... Uh, what's it called? I can picture it. I can't... 
remember what it's called. Endurance, open wheel, and muscle? Is that what it is? Classes at There's level a 3. Touring championship for the upcoming season. And then we'll have a, um, a grid... Whatchamacallit? <laughs> Whatchamacallit? A... The, the grid series thingy <laughs> to go. Alright, so... There's uh, a new street championship open this season. That's going to be it for today. I, um, how would one create a custom race? I see you asking for the custom race. I guess I'll do it. Uh, we'll do... What kind of car do I want? Shelby Cup, 4 GT. GT Ultimate, race type. It's going to be race, one event, AI drivers, uh, medium I guess, advanced options, damage full, flashbacks five, alright well we're turning assists off, or flashbacks off for this, you wanted, no assists as well. Definitely, uh. We're doing the full track on this thing. Just because that seems like the track I like. One event. Oh, I left. Did that save my settings at least? It didn't. Ah. And. Ah, I changed the track. That's it. It changed my vehicle though, didn't it? Party mode, demolition derby. I was in the endurance and I was in the GT ultimate. Is that what I want? I don't know if that's what I want. What car do I want, guys? I'm saying tuner. Let's go muscle. Super modified. <laughs> Let's go super modified. The Mazda and the Subaru here. with the Mazda. Just because I need to turn off all the assists though. That's gonna hopefully that's probably gonna save my settings, isn't it? Wait, what? That's not the track I chose, did it? What? I got gypped. I got gypped. <laughs> Alright, you want a tuner. GT40. Hmm. Is 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 tuner the class or the vehicle discipline? Well, well, uh, obviously, tuner is the vehicle discipline. Uh, GT40 is that's a car. What uh, is it not? Or is it a class? I wish there wasn't a stream delay. <laughs> you guys are just seeing me exit the race now. Endurance, so you're saying, no. all right. GT40? Oh, that one? All right. 
we can do that and event det details as far as track goes uh, Indianapolis mm, that would be neat especially have a full <laughs> I could do that oh man that would be silly I might have to do that the whole circuit of Indianapolis there's San Francisco I'm like uh, you guys make up your minds <laughs> All right, we're doing the oval then. <laughs> That's ridiculous. We're doing the oval, we're gonna do five laps. And we're gonna, yeah, that's it. Advanced options, they're still the same. And done, hopefully because we, uh, I've only got that car to choose from. Oh wait, never mind. this is this car, never mind. we're good. <laughs> It tricked me. Let's hopefully hope it uh, did our settings right. <laughs> this is gonna be silly. All right. Vehicle upgrades. Oh yeah, I want to install the upgrades. Why not? <laughs> All right, now I need to change the the difficulty settings. Damage level full, AI difficulty medium, transmission. I'm gonna keep that automatic. Trash control off, everything off. Entire HUD. <laughs> Racing line. We're gonna turn that off. And uh, we'll keep camera position how it is. Should I? I guess we'll do. We'll do interior. We'll try to make it as realistic as possible. Maybe I'll switch it to to manual. I don't know. I don't even know how to shift gears in this game, to be honest. So is there controls where I can look that up? Yeah. Full stop and comma. By full stop, does it mean period? Alright, we're gonna assume that's <laughs> the period and the comma. Well then. Huh. <laughs> Guys. Alright, after this race, we're done though. I will do the San Francisco one next time, remind me. I'm in the interior view. Oh, right, right, right. Manual shifting. I knew that. There's a reason I never play games, uh, racing games with a manual shifter, manual transmission. I suck at it, that's why. I should draft these guys. Oop, shifted the wrong way. Oh, that's as high up as we can shift. Wow, there's a wall. Wow, we're spinning. I have no rewinds. Oh, oh. Alright. Well, that worked well. <laughs> Hopefully this doesn't get us for corner cutting because I'm using this to get back on the track. Hopefully it doesn't lead to the pits. Man, my car is hurting. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> uh, 
I'm probably gonna mess this corner up again, aren't I? I need to remember to slow down for it. So let's brake and downshift. I probably broke too much. Man, I'm way too close to the inside. I don't like the first person view because I can't tell very well if my car is drifting. If you're using a controller on a console, then the, you'd have force feedback to tell you, but like the, vib the vibrate thing. Dual shock, as PlayStation would call it. Hopefully, this isn't too fast for this corner. Fifth gear seems to be good for most things. But not always. Oh, that guy spun out. This guy looks like he got slowed down by it, too. Excuse me, come through on the inside. It's a really bad idea. I knew that. <laughs> Why did I think going on the inside was a good idea on the grass? You're right, you need to shift. I always forget that. Not used to using the manual transmission at all. I imagine though if you master the manual transmission it is faster. Use it. Right, taking this corner fast again. Well, we're on the grass. We know how both of these things worked out previously. Catching up with this guy. I'm not sure if he had trouble. This is probably the same guy I spent out trying to pass last time. Wow, you came wide all of a sudden. Oh, right, shifting. That's <laughs> I'm going to keep doing that. We're in the last lap, though, so... Looks like we're getting ninth. That could have gone better, but uh, it really could have gone worse, too. Alright, wow! <laughs> the back half of my car is missing, I didn't even know it. <laughs> Alright. That... <laughs> <laughs> that was entertaining, but... Right. <laughs> I'm not last. I know, it's a miracle. I'm going to log on here to play next time in the stream, and I'm going to forget that everything's in uh, manual transmission and all the assists are off and everything like that, and I'm going to have a horrible time. Well, I'm going to realize I'm in manual mode right away, but the manual transmission, but... Um, one guy didn't finish the race. He must have been the one person that uh, I saw on the grass. I didn't see him again, though. Maybe he's... I don't know. Anyway, uh, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you all enjoyed. Uh, <laughs> next time, we'll have to do the San Francisco track afterwards. Remind me. And we'll have to do the Demolition Derby figure eight race type thing mode. Those are wall words in the proper sentence. At some point, too. Uh, so I'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye.